so I'll be adding interested finds from this coloring book. And this paragraph is talking about AI, but this is talking about it as in two words, as if. And this is a philosophy mind. Not quite sure yet. I'm just beginning, but it's it's nineteen seventy eight. I think it was published. He's been talking about nuclear power and how our mind or you know already we were worried about ourselves, but then it's or not worried and then thinking of like the whole. But basically, we don't. Basically, we don't realize how easy total total annihilation of humankind can come and how it's come many times in the past and whether we're even it's us here. I don't believe in nuclear power anymore. Um, I think that's a cover up for the free energy. Um, I do believe the bomb places. Um, yeah, I watched a really good um, animal thing on Chernobyl, how all the animals have taken back over and everything and the flora and fauna are all fine. See you know, lies. I'll, be, I'll find that and post it. So I'll read it quick. The first is containing the two words as if, which blah, 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 turned into a once influential philosoph philosophical system. The philosophy of as if, briefly, it means that man has no choice but to live by fictions. Interest in the controllers and the actors. As if the illusory world of the scenes represented ultimate reality. As if he had a free will which made him responsible for his actions. As if there was a God to reward virtuous conduct and so on. Similarly, the individual must live as if he were not under sentence of death. And humanity must plan for its future as if its days were not counted. It is only by virtue of these fictions that the mind of man fabricated habitual universe and endowed it with meaning. So to me, as if AI, artificial intelligence as they're calling it now, but I believe the true AI is as if. You know, it's funny that as kids, as if, as if that's real, as if. That's what we used to say when we were young. Anyone from Red Carol will probably still say it now, and I think I probably do occasionally. Okay.